Good afternoon, welcome to number two, Charles Crescent. Situated within Queen's Park, one of Chester's most prestigious locations. Only a short walk away from the River Dee, stunning walks along the meadows, but you can also get into the city very, very easily across the historic suspension bridge. So it's a beautiful part of the world to live. Very, very quiet suburb, but you're on the outskirts of the city centre whilst being close to the River Dee. Now behind me is a really unique opportunity. Properties like this very rarely come up within Queen's Park. It's completely undeveloped, approximately a quarter of an acre plot. Um, it's hard to judge exactly how large the rear garden is because it's quite overgrown at the moment. So you will need to get, make friends with a tree surgeon. But there's a great opportunity here either to remodel what's here in a great location or even subject to any planning permissions or building consents, maybe even rebuild something from, from the ground upwards. But what you are buying is a beautiful slice of location within Queen's Park. So I'm going to give you a rough um, sort of tour around this. Not the easiest one to show you around via video. Now this is obviously the front the driveway here, so plenty of off-road parking. There's a single garage here. What lies at the moment is a double-fronted 1950s detached home. Like I say, with very large southerly facing rear gardens. So once that's cleared, you are going to have one of the most spectacular plots within Queen's Park itself. So I'll show you around the back just to give you a flavour, but we will be using some drone footage, which will give you a much better view of the plot from above. Like I say, what we have done is just made the plot accessible so you can do a 360 tour around the property. But what we haven't done is obviously clear the entirety of the plot. So you can just see the sun just trying to flicker through the leaves of the trees there at the moment. Like I say, the gardens go, go back quite a lot actually. So there's loads and loads of room. If you're keeping the original structure, obviously there's lots of space to extend here. You know, you could do something full width, two storeys. Again, subject to any necessary planning or building content. So that is essentially what we are selling, which is a very, very big southerly facing plot in a quiet cul-de-sac where properties very rarely become available. Now I'll give you a quick whiz round tour of the actual house itself. Like I say the property will need a full scheme of modernization if you're gonna keep it in its current format. But I think there's plenty of options of things that you could do with this property. So as we go into the entrance hall, I say it's double fronted. And then we go into the living room where we've got some parquet flooring for a dual aspect, original fireplace. So front to back, if you're keeping it as it was, you've got some lovely parquet flooring to work with. And then from the entrance hall, we've got a separate dining room. Again, open original fire, bay fronted at the front, still got the, uh, the hatch to the kitchen. Double cloaks covered the hair. Back of the house, we've got the kitchen in its current format, gas central heating boiler, understairs pantry cupboard. So we have got provision for gas. We have got running water, so the sink and drain there overlooking what's currently the back garden. Here we have an outer hallway with access to a very useful utility space and integral garage just through here. I'll just take you up to the first floor where we have three double side bedrooms. I love this leaded original window. So of the bedrooms, we've got the master bedroom here, which has got the bay, so it's a good size. And then continuing to the front of the property, another good size double bedroom. And last but not least, there's a third bedroom here, overlooks the back. I'll probably give you a bit of a view from outside the window. You probably won't see a great deal more than what I showed you on ground level. You certainly need to bring some boots if you come in to view this property. Separate WC, and in here we have the current bathroom with actually a Twyford's original sink there. Airing cupboard, hot water cylinder. So the property is sure to have a lot of demand. You will need a very large deposit to be able to purchase the property given the amount of work that's needed. Um, so a sizable deposit or a cash purchase. Like I said, I think there's gonna be lots and lots of interest. So register and we'll, get you, we'll let you know when our open day is gonna take place. I'm sure I'll be here on hand to hopefully explain any options that you may have. Our number at Current Homes is 01244 313 900. Thanks for watching.